Hey, I'm Nell Zaid, product manager here at Polaris Snowmobiles, and today we're gonna to go over the industry-leading powertrains that power our Polaris snowmobiles. We're gonna start with the Patriot engine family. So, in 2019, we launched the 850 Patriot, and it represented a totally new clean sheet design for two strokes here at Polaris. When we just started with the 850, the plan was always for all of these powertrains that you see in front of you today. And it's really exciting to have all of these come to life and you guys get to go out and experience them. We'll start with the 850 Patriot, which is the benchmark of the family. Lots of power, lots of response, awesome durability, and it's an awesome motor in a trail sled, crossover sled, or a mountain sled, and you can get it right at your dealership showroom floor. From the 850, we're gonna move over to the 650, and we got a 650 here in this XCR. The 650 is based on the 850 Patriot. They share a lot of the same components, the same bottom end. Uh, displacement just bumped down to, to 650. The 650's become a true fan favorite, especially in trail sleds, and has been awesome to have in Voyager as well. It's super smooth power, awesome durability, great acceleration corner to corner, uh, and delivers a lot of really awesome fuel economy and efficiency gains, especially over a lot of the 600s. Now we'll go over to the Patriot 9R, and this is the first engine we're gonna talk about today that's a part of our factory mod engine family. So the 9R is a 900cc two-stroke twin, that's based again on our 850 Patriot platform. And it's essentially the race mod version of our 850. It was developed on the Rimshaw course with our hill climb team in the 900 improved and mod class. And it has a ton of really awesome goodies that make it super responsive and super powerful. So it has a lightweight rotating assembly and a lightweight crank. So it's 3% lower inertia uh, on the crank train itself. And the motor is a pound and a half lighter than an 850. So lots of lightweight goodies that make it rev up super quick and hit really hard. Obviously bored out to 900 cc. Uh, so it delivers 12% more torque than an 850 and 7% more power. We offer this motor in our RMK and it is the ultimate weapon for tight technical trees. Uh, it's super quick, hits really hard, and fires up that track immediately and gets the vehicle moving. It's really incredible response that we're really excited to have out in the mountains. And from 9R, we'll go to the top of the Patriot family. And this is the second in our factory mod motors. Uh, this is the Patriot Boost. So this is an 850cc two-stroke twin, again, an 850 Patriot base uh, with a unique turbocharger system on top of it. I want to start by talking about the, the base motor. I mentioned earlier that it's all about the Patriot family. This was all designed together. And this is, this is no exception. The 850 Patriot, uh, the base motor for the Boost, only has an extra set of injectors and a different set of pistons. This is the only thing needed to make it ready for nine pounds of boost with a warranty, uh, which is what we see here. Uh, really proving out the durability and the testament to how well it was all designed together. When we look at the Patriot Boost system itself, the magic is what we call Smart Boost, and it's all about seamless control every single day, every single ride. Um, the external wastegate up here, which is actually up on the tune pipe, is what makes Smart Boost work, and what it does is it unlocks a new level of combustion stability in the engine and allows us to pull a lot more power and a lot more smooth control out of the engine. So nine PSI a boost up at 10,000 feet. Uh, at, at sea level, it makes 10% more power than an 850 Patriot. Uh, we boost all the way up to 10,000 feet and maintain that level uh, and delivers 50% more power than an 850 Patriot does at 10,000 feet. In our RMK lineup, that power that high in the mountains is just incredible and unlocks new terrain and how our riders are able to ride. And then for 2023, we put the Patriot Boost in our Indy VR1 and Switchback Assault. Now, that was the first time anybody had ever put a production two-stroke turbo in a trail sled, and we were able to do that because of the smart boost control that I talked about earlier. So, making 10% more power than an 850 at sea level, we put that into an Indy VR1 and a Switchback Assault, and it makes that power wherever you are on the trails. What it delivers in the trail sled is super unique. It delivers hyper sled speed and power. It makes a ton of power. And when you're reaching those higher speeds, a naturally aspirated engine will simply fall off. It struggles to continue to build top speed and a boost just blows right through it. It builds speed like nothing else in the industry. But we didn't want to trade off handling. We're really proud of how our trail sleds handle, VR1s and, and assaults handle on and off the trail. And we weren't willing to give that up. Patriot Boost being only 25 pounds heavier than an 850 Patriot doesn't have a lot of the handling challenges that some of the heavier four-stroke turbos do. Our Indy VR1 is 85 pounds lighter than its competitor in a four-stroke turbo. So all of the goodness of all the awesome handling that you get with an Indy VR1, now just with hyper sled speed and power. 
Next up is our ProStar S4, and this was a new engine for us in 2023, and one we're really excited to have in the lineup. It's the first four-stroke from Polaris in quite a while, and fits really nicely with our Indy, Voyager, and Titan snowmobiles. So, this is a 1,000cc dual overhead cam, uh, inline twin four-stroke, naturally aspirated and fits right in that under 100 horsepower class. And the architecture is, is our ProStar architecture, which we've been using in off-road vehicles for quite a long time. So even though this is a new engine for snow and comes with a lot of snow specific pieces to make it work really well, it, the architecture comes already proven. The durability and reliability is super solid and we're really excited to have it out in the field. Like I mentioned, it's the off-road architecture and that proven ProStar design, but there are quite a few pieces that we had to do to make sure it worked really well in a snowmobile. It had to be a good snowmobile engine, and this certainly is. A few that I wanna highlight, this has a dry sump oil system, and so what that allowed us to do is really shrink the engine vertically. And that allowed us to put the engine low into the chassis and make sure we got that center of mass as low as we could. Helps handling and uh, making sure that the vehicle is still nice to ride. A couple other pieces. Uh, this one has an electronic throttle with really smooth control and three different modes. So eco, standard, and sport, which lets the rider tune in the ride for how they want to ride and how they want to use their sled that day. All of that worked into the ProStar S4, really enables it to work really well in Indy, Voyager, and Titan snowmobiles. So in our Indy trail sleds, it's really smooth power delivery, great fuel economy, low maintenance, especially if you're gonna put on a lot of miles. In our Voyager and Titan, where you're trying to do a lot of different things with the vehicle, lots of versatility and the low end power for pulling sleds or, or cargo or a passenger. And then again, that easy maintenance and easy ownership of the four stroke. Rounding out the lineup is our 550 Liberty engine. This is our fan cooled carbureted 550 twin two stroke that provides really awesome performance and a ton of versatility being fan cooled at a great value. Uh, in our Indy and Switchback lineup, it's an awesome entry into trail and crossover snowmobiles. All the different Voyager models with our 550 that offer performance, capability, and versatility all at a great value. The six engines that we've got in the Polaris family really cover however you want to ride. Whether you want to ride Patriot Boost blasting down the trails on a VR1, go tackle the tight trees on a 9R RMK, or take the ProStar S4 out onto the ice and go ice fishing, we've got an engine that fits your ride.